Hello guys, welcome to my channel. So whenever you launch Star Trek Infinite game on your Windows computer and it opens Paradox Launcher. Now if you want to skip or bypass Paradox Launcher then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now to skip the Paradox Launcher you can close the launcher if it is open and then make a right click on the game in Steam and then select manage then click on browse local files. It will straight away take you to the game installation folder over here you can see infinite rd infinite exe file so you can see these two files you can launch the game using this exe file so make a double click on this exe file and it will straight away launch the game it will here you can see it skipped the launcher so this is how you can skip the launcher you can launch the game from the game installation folder let me close the game first and if this does not work then you can try different step to skip the launcher uh, you can copy this location this location is provided uh, this path is provided in the video description so you can copy this command and then make a right click on the game select properties in the launch option you can paste this command if the game is installed in c drive so here you can see it's c drive if the game is installed in c drive you can paste it over here and then close this and then launch the game but in my case the game is not installed in c drive it is installed in d drive so you can copy this command as it is and you can paste it somewhere so let me paste it over here and then go to the game installation folder make a right click select manage then click on browse local files and this is the installation folder for me so in my case it's in d drive so i will copy this path and then instead of c drive till here Till infinite because it does not here you can see infinite rd dot r and infinite underscore rd dot exe so till here till infinite you can just replace the path the new path over here so copy this and then paste it over here from the beginning keep the inverted commas do not put any space after inverted commas and till here you can paste the new path and then you can copy this new path in my case it's in d drive so i will make a right click select properties and then paste the new path over here and then close this and then click on play and this will also launch the game straight away it will skip the launcher so here you can see it skipped the launcher so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to skip or bypass the Paradox Launcher. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.